specifically several times, no fire. Uh-huh. And you, what, just decided that you weren't going to see me again, or? No. Uh, we read the permit sign out there, and it said with a fire permit or with a special permit that you can have fires. And as we were coming through yesterday, we saw several fires, so we assumed. After I talked to you very yes, specifically and said you cannot have a fire or a charcoal barbecue. Can I ask why you're you just... You only have a propane barbecue. Can I ask why you're just all of a sudden coming in with such a bad attitude? Because I talked to this gentleman on Friday. So you can't just come in here and be cool and talk? I did that on you Friday. You don't have to have this authority thing I about it. I did that on Friday. I was very friendly. I said that you cannot have, that we are in a very strict fire restriction. It's a $350 fine. Okay, I understand that. that. If I saw him, I understand I that, but I'm just telling, I'm just asking you because we are men amongst men. Uh-huh. You are not above anybody. Why are you talking to us like children? Because you act like children. When I, when, when we I, act when like I children. With this gentleman and this woman over here. On Friday I don't care. That doesn't mean you're going to talk to me or him like we're children. It doesn't make any difference. You can just calmly talk to us. At any rate, this fire needs to be put out with water till it's cold to the touch right now. Mm-hmm. Or we show you a fire permit. I don't care what you show me. It doesn't matter what kind of fire permit you have. There is no fire allowed on all BLM land. Well, like I said, don't state. talk to me in that tone, please. I'm respectfully asking you not I'm to as a man. I'm asking you to please put out the fire right now with water. Until it's cold to the touch. We will uh, right. hop on the internet and uh, check that out. Because no. from what we... Please, are you, are you going to put the fire out now? I don't know. Craig, that's up to you. I'm going to put the fire out. Okay. The listing didn't say that you could have a permit? <laughs> oh, they are training. Okay. Well, that was a misunderstanding, but I just don't I don't respect the way that he talked to us. There's no reason. That was awesome, old buck. Don't talk to me like that. There's no reason for it. That was awesome. Well man, we can we can talk just like we're talking now. Because he can't do anything. And he knows that. Where's the water? He can't he's out, yeah. Oh, he's gonna look hold for on, something on, now. He's gonna get us for a dog being loose. Good morning. Uh, uh, so we're probably why you're here. Yeah, and I don't think. Hey, are you our problem, children? <laughs> Not me. I've got video of how he came up and how he was talking to us. The dog's not gonna bite, right? No, and she's got him on leash. How are you doing this morning? Good. How are you guys? We're great. Good. 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 We're great. Good. The situation is, so we had a fire going. Just I was just going to say, advance. I can put in the truck if got it, like. got it, got it. Where are you guys from? I'm, I'm in Madera County, just oh, okay. directional. Up from Arizona. Yeah. Good morning. How are you doing? Nice to meet you, Craig. Craig. Good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Good to meet you, Steve. Um, he, he just came in with, immediately before we even said anything, a bad attitude. And I've got it on video. And I just, we did put up fire. Mm-hmm. We had a permit, so we had, you know, we misunderstood. We thought because we had the permit and we read that we could have it, um, so we did put out the fire. Okay. We never disrespected him, but the entire time he was here, he disrespected us. And I can, I can show you on video the yeah, whole time. Sure. You want to see it? Yeah. You know, we just want to get along with our, our business and That's keep fine. our area bust up and not bug anybody. And we're gonna be here a couple more days and and then head on out. I'm just saying know. hi. <laughs> I'm just looking at the camera. Yeah. <laughs> so, and, and, and we really appreciate you guys coming out here and being cool about it. Yeah. No, it's yeah. no big deal. And and he was having radio problems, so we weren't sure what his problem yeah. was. Cause of course. All, he, all we kept getting was just his call sign, and we didn't know what was going on until we just almost got here, and they said, oh, it's a campfire issue. We're like, oh, okay. Yeah. You know, <laughs> it, it happens. It's understandable right now, especially because of our forest, and we haven't oh, had yeah. a big fire yet this year. So we're just waiting for it. And trying to keep yeah. from having that. Exactly. Yeah. And we do have good people that are here having fires no big deal and then we have the knuckleheads that are here and flicking their cigarettes and creating oh, yeah. a problem so we have both sides of the coin you know and, um, i mean i've got pocket full ex- of cigarette butts I yeah don't... not to excuse his behavior by any means but you know we don't have a problem yeah. <laughs> you know um so before you guys leave it'd be great to oh, we'll know bring if him over we can we'll go figure by. It out. yeah we'll because... figure it out before we leave we'll figure it out yeah him saying the entire state i know that was a liar off the bat 
Yeah. Well, he has. Yeah, that's cool. I'm not special person. Putting you guys on video, I'm just getting audio well, because you guys are nice. cool. So, yeah, I mean, you can video you're... all you want. Not Go ahead, buddy. Let me know which yeah. is my bad side. But my good it. side, though. It happens, <laughs> it happens to us all the time. People open the door and they got an okay. iPad in their hand. You're being videoed, you think? <laughs> you know, it doesn't. It doesn't bother us. It doesn't. Yeah. It doesn't matter. The, uh, this is like this you. is the issue that uh, we're going to run into down here. Um, the permit says, yeah, you have a California campfire permit. It's a special limitation. Some areas have special limitations regarding campfire use. Here. And that's what we checked for the sign down there. It says, with a permit, you can have a fire. So well, right now, uh, he says it's posted up on the board, absolutely 100% no campfire. That's not what it says. Well, just it, let's listen to him. It, uh, um, you know, coming in, I see the signs, four separate signs, no campfires. Um, even no charcoal campfires, just propane. And that's kind of what he's claiming. I said, hey, you have a permit. He's quoting this special limitations saying, I don't care if they have a permit or not. They cannot have a fire because our restrictions here in the canyon are no campfires or charcoal fires whatsoever. So in essence, we can uh, we can sit here and, and negotiate and reason and talk about it all day long as to what that actually means mm -hmm. um, I think for uh, um, all of us involved here including him um, I know it's kind of getting chilly at night guys I mean it really is in this morning but um, so we don't have to come down here and do this all over again yeah, um, no I have to get a fresh press uniform for the next camera <laughs> um, that uh um, no fires. No fires. Not a problem. And then it will be cool. Okay. Not a problem. Because next time he calls, he's he's gonna want citations and all kinds of. Crazy. The propane's fine. The stove's still fine. Propane. Yeah. Propane is fine. Can well, I'll check the signs on yes, the way out. We can't have a fire. <laughs> we can't have a fire. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. Yeah. What kind of roast is it, by the way? <laughs> <laughs> I saw your breakfast. You know. Oh, I know. Back, back in, started getting hungry. Your thoughts? Actually, we're about to have um, burritos. No, I'm yeah. fine. Oh. <laughs> you are just completely oh. confused, aren't you? You don't know what to do. What happened? You don't know what to do. Well, can I ask you a favor? If you do walk out and see somewhere that it does say that we... Not yet. Not yeah, with the permit, we are allowed to have fire. Would you take the time to let us? Yeah, or we'll advise. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Just the cold water. Okay. Yeah, I guess not. Just, no, I'm, well, yeah. we're going to go right around the corner. So, so the yes. Okay. But, so hard you know, crack. in the grand scheme of things, of what we're dealing with, I mean, this is a constant thing. We come down to the port. Yeah. He warns them, and then people argue, and the end result is the fire gets put out. And they won't be as hard and cracked. And then you put some lotion in. And even if. Them back up for us, be, I mean, she won't be so owie. You look at this canyon, <laughs> and it's a it's a tinderbox. Yeah, it really is. Oh, we we you know we're no, we got no problem following the law. The only like I said oh, earlier, no. the only re reason you're here is because he was yeah. an ass. But I, I well, explained I apologize to him for you guys having a crappy that. day with him. That sucks. Well, no, I, I hate it for you guys. I had to come all the way out here for it. But like I said it's a beautiful day. <laughs> it just gives me an advantage to ask a question. I'm from Arizona. Um, hey, from what I understand, in camp. I can have a concealed weapon. I don't have one on me right now, but and I've got a concealed weapons permit in Arizona, but I know that's not retroactive to here. But by law, out of state parks, can I have a weapon on me, my pocket? You know, how does that work on BLM land or Forest Service federal land? Would you just like him, just show it. Yeah. Just don't conceal it. If you have it concealed and we come up, just let us know you have a concealed weapons permit. Yeah. Let me know you got a gun on you or there's one in the tree. Just let me know some sort. Of course. You know, and, yeah. and other than that, I don't think you're going to have an issue with us. You know, yeah. it's us, mm. us hillbillies up here I know that everybody has them. <laughs> yeah. So it's not a big deal. I mean, the way you're walking around with your hands in your pocket, I already thought you had one. Um, yeah. So just, just let First us know. First thing I saw was him as soon as I got out of the car was yeah. the Glock. Yeah. I didn't even see the badge. Yeah. The badge. I, didn't even, I didn't even see the badge. And I'm like, oh, here we go. Just, <laughs> you know, I respect my hands are out of my pockets when you yeah. guys first walked up so that yeah you know, just let us know you but, can kind of tell when we came up we were like okay yeah we can tell who we're dealing with most of the time sure, you know especially sure. up here so if you guys can just let us know that you've got one you're not gonna have really an issue with okay. us um, i appreciate that you know beyond that yeah you will okay hi sweetie i saw your feet hurt 
All right. Well, I appreciate the answer. You guys will have a good day. You too. Take care. <laughs> Take care. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. you. Guys Take we'll care. let you know. We're going to go look at that sign real quick. And okay. We'll come back. We'll come back if there's any changes. But at this point. Yeah. No fires unless we hear from you. Okay. Thank you. Thanks for your time. Take care.